As you might already know, I am not a huge fan of winter. I know the snow is melting and it's getting warmer, but for sure not prettier. So I was walking home the other day and uh, you know it was getting dark, it was wet and generally unpleasant. When I was crossing the street I noticed something. There was a bit of water standing by the curb and I noticed all these beautiful colors in it and well let's make it clear the water was actually very dirty. But there were some vivid colors shining through it that I just I just couldn't help myself. I actually looked closer and <laughs> you probably have seen this tons of times. Uh, it, it was uh, like some kind of oil or gasoline or something like that uh, spilled and mixed with the dirty water. There were all these colors and I don't know what it was with the reflection of the light. I don't know, but just it looks so pretty. <laughs> I know it's some silly, but it looked pretty. End of story. When I got home, I still had that image in my head. <laughs> I know. And uh, you know, I kept seeing the spilled oil and actually at some point I felt amused with myself and I thought what the heck am I doing obsessing about the beauty of spilled oil I mean there's so many beautiful things in the planet right so oil that um I know we need it but still stinky whatever gasoline we burn in our cars and creates all that pollution I mean what was wrong with me Right? What's pretty about oil? What's so beautiful about it? I just... Ugh, confusion. That made me think about um, the relativity of beauty and how sometimes in certain circumstances the least expected object appears beautiful. And in other times, when you are surrounded by beauty, you don't really feel the impact of it. I was at the florist the other day and I was kind of in a rush so I just walked in picked what I needed and left and uh, well why am I telling you this because I was surrounded by all these beautiful flowers and I didn't stand in the middle with my eyes wide open thinking oh how beautiful no I just paid and left and here I am staring at the oil or gasoline spilled in the middle of the street I don't know. I just had to paint that tiny oil spill. Not just because I thought it looked beautiful, but also because it reminds me that beauty can be so relative. The dark vignette around all three canvases reminds me that we are looking inside something dark and dirty. Like my dark socks that I used to dance up around the house. There are many, many, many uh, small circles and those were meant to be the drops of rain. Not only it is uh, dirty water, it is raining too, so yucks. I have this luck that every time since it's going to rain, I carry an umbrella, then it doesn't rain and then it looks like it's gonna rain. I don't carry an umbrella because I feel brave and then it rains. And guess what I have in my house? A collection of umbrellas that then people borrow and never give back. You know who you are! The vivid colors showing through are the colors of the spilled oil, of course, you know, what else? 
And the three following black lines is the dirty water that doesn't really want to mix with the oil. The light spot on the left canvas is a reflection of the street light. It was getting dark already, and well, when I saw it, and the street light was on. You know, the whole thing reminds me uh, when I was a kid, I would um, take all these leaves and stick them into a um, wooden stick. I will cut the, I will, you know, put them all together, and to me, it was the most beautiful flower bouquet ever. Now I know, you know, now I know it will just be a bunch of leaves on a stick. But is it a real flower bouquet from a florist uh, more beautiful or a diamond or a expensive watch or purse more beautiful? You tell me. I know what I think. You tell me. Let me know. Now I said that's all I'm gonna say to you. Alright guys, I will see you next Sunday. Bye! Eat your cookies! Hmm.